It's been a rough year for the Toronto Wolfpack, and today they found out they won't be playing the Super League next season. The team confirmed that they have lost their bid for reinstatement into Super League next year. The decision was made by the other 11 Super League teams. Their future with the league has been in limbo since standing down on July 20th. The club says they are now going to take some time to consider their position and consult further with the current ownership group. Now the NBA draft is just a few weeks away and it's been a unique challenge for teams to prepare for the life-changing moment for the athletes. There's never been a moment, um, I mean, since I've been working in the NBA where um, you're, you're, you're scouting for a draft and the following season has already started in different parts of the world. So it's, it's very strange, you know, there's some international prospects that were actually watching the beginning of their season, but yet they're in this year's draft. The draft will be held virtually on November 18th. Looking right, going right, end zone, touchdown! It's Claypool with the touchdown catch. The Pittsburgh Steelers rally to remain the lone unbeaten team in the NFL with Canada's Chase Claypool helping them win by no big deal. Catching the game, winning TD, helping the Steelers get past the Baltimore Ravens 28 to 24. And it's over 24 hours after losing to the Steelers, the Baltimore Ravens announced that Marlon Humphrey has tested positive for COVID-19 and he's now in isolation. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.